Annie and it is time to do the Swamp Family Mail of the week. And I'm sorry I look like a sassy hot mess right now, but I've been wearing this makeup all day. Look, I got flicky flecks of mascara. That's probably an unacceptable state to be filming a YouTube video, but I'm gonna do it anyway. I've been running around doing crazy stuff all day. I feel like everything is just madness over here right now because I'm trying to do daily videos for you guys, yet I'm also trying to film a lot of Halloween videos for October. So I feel like now I'm only uploading a video every other day. It's frustrating, it's mind boggling, but let's just say October is gonna be extra sassy. I can't stay too long tonight because I have to wake up at nine o'clock in the morning to go take a cactus class. I'm so excited. I love cactuses, cacti. I love succulents. And I'm gonna go learn how to like plant them and do all kinds of cool things. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I may try and film a couple segments. You never know with me. I hate when people assume that people like to do morning time activities. Some of us like to wake up and start our lives at noon. No earlier than noon. Thanks. As promised in my last Swamp Family Mail video, I wanted to show you guys some of the letters and also my grotesque fallen out hair, quite apparently. But I wanted to show you guys how I keep all of you guys' letters who send me letters. That is a very repetitious use of the word letters. But a lot of people like to believe that I don't care about the letters, that I don't keep the letters, that I don't read the letters. I see a lot of snarky comments regarding things like that. And I just want to be like, you don't know my life. I swear, if you write like a piece of post-it note, if you pick up a scrippy scrap of paper, I keep it and I put it in here. And look, a lot of you guys send me really awesome and interesting photographs, which I later display somewhere in my realm. This is my newest one, so it's not even completely uh, filled up. But I swear, you send me a postcard, I keep it. You send me a scrap of paper from a magazine. Some people send me magazine articles that they find interesting. I keep those too. I keep everything. That's just the kind of person that I am. And later I try and go back and go through and scan in some of the drawings and some of the envelopes even that you guys decorate and I put them on my Tumblr page which is just graveyardgirl.com and uh, this is my newest binder that's not completely filled up yet. Almost though. And this is the one that I had before that. Literally every single I fill these things to the brim. Sometimes if I don't even keep the entire envelope. I keep like scraps of the envelope, like I cut it out. I just choose not to share the letters. A lot of the stuff that you guys write and share with me is really personal aspects of your life. So that's mostly why I do it is because I don't want to just come up on here and read something that they only wanted me to know. And I'm a great secret keeper. So if you're having problems or you're struggling and you just want to write to somebody and tell me what's going on. I'm a good listener. Reading and opening letters and stuff is part of my everyday activity. I go to my P.O. box every single day and get the letters and open them and put them in these binders. I've got tons of binders all across the top of my closet. I will keep them forever until the day I die and then after that I will bequeath them to someone else. So if you write me a letter it's gonna be on earth for all eternity till the sun makes the earth explode in some kind kind of really catastrophic way that I don't want to envision. But I just wanted to absolutely let you guys know that I absolutely, can I say absolutely a few more times? I don't ever get rid of them letters. I keep them forever. Sometimes I reread them. Now it's time for me to do that creepy thing with the knife. Let's get into some boxes. The uh, very first one with this mustache tape on it. Oh, it even says open on camera. Looks like I'm doing that. This box comes from Annie in Texas. Slicing, slicing. Oh, I forgot to sing the song. You have to clap because I can't clap. I got the mail, the mail, the sassy mail, the sassy mail. We're gonna make that into a musical, Awkward Broadway. Trying to not lose some appendages. Ha ha ha. Oh, we got newspaper. So excited. So excited. Oh, this is fascinating. Oh, it's on a pin. Look at this spinny flower object that I could use to hypnotize my enemies. Also, we got a teddy bar. <gasps> Ooh, this is so excited. Look, um, we have a fluffy, feathery bunny ears. 
Do you? Are you seeing this? Are you observing this? We got this scarf with them skeletons all over it. We know I like that. Oh! Oh my god! That looks like We also have a tiara. I want to wear that so I can be the swamp queen. I don't know what accent that was. That was an embarrassing accent. That's what that was. I got the mail. The mail. The sassy mail. The sassy mail. Thank you so much, Annie. I'm gonna grab one here from the back. This comes from Zoe. It's a box. Let's slice it open. Ooh, it looks like somebody already started to slice for me. Don't take my slicing privileges away. <laughs> Opening the box. Sock tight. This was a birthday present. She sent some Ritter Sport chocolate. Ooh, this feels melty and squishy. That's exciting. Also, she sent me the new Vampire Weekend album and I love Vampire Weekend. I saw them in concert once and I haven't gotten to hear the new album yet, so I am so excited. And she sent me 500 Days of Summer, which I've heard is a really good movie and I've never gotten to see it. So thank you so much, Zoe. Now I can watch it and know that it's a good movie. Thank you so much. This highly decorated box comes from Krista and this is so cute. I don't even want to tear the paper. That's how we do it on the swamp and we've got a little illustration of man cat and tea with the tea angels that bring me the tea and my personal favorite these skeletons that are doing some kind of dance i ain't even gonna slice it on that side because i'm gonna save that piece of paper <gasps> it's a cordless phone i don't know if that's actually what's in that would be awesome i could like cordlessly call people it's worms 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 i do vacuum these up by the way, some people seem to think that I'm some kind of heathen that leaves trash all over my floor. Look, we've got a box. It's like a pink box with a spike on top. That's exciting. Ooh, I feel something fluffy. We have a gator. He's like a dino gator, but he's awfully fluffy. I like him so much. Do mm. oh, I look sexy? <gasps> Shut up. This is so exciting. It's a bop it pin. I freaking love bop it. And we've got a lovely letter. Thank you so much, Krista. Next we have this awesome box and it's got like a gummy bear on it, which is very exciting for me. I do love a good gummy bear. Slicing. Oh, that was almost a finger. <gasps> no. I didn't know there was an illustration slash diorama on the inside of the lid and I just sliced it. I'm sorry. It's like gummy bear Shambhala. I didn't mean to rip their paradise. I'm so sorry. It still looks good. I can still dance around. I just like cut into their sun heart up here. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. This comes from Maria. Hey, Ooh, what is this? Oh my gosh. These are so cute. Okay. They're like these little string voodoo dolls. Look, they shake and jangle. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's another one. These are so freaking cute. Look, this one's like a little angel. Oh, he's a raven. Oh my god. It's like an Edgar Allan Poe thing. Protects your heart from sorrow so it will be broken nevermore. Oh my god. That's so cute. I think I'm gonna hang these all in my car. I'm that kind of person. Cutting the tape. Cutting the tape. Can we have a creepy cutting the tape song? <gasps> what is this? I like it a lot. Oh my god, it's got a gator on top. I bet it's a gator claw. Gator tooth claw. I really thoroughly enjoy this. Thank you. And we got a plasticky gator. I have a fine collection of these. Yes, I do. Oh, that was extra loud. He's even louder than me. I didn't think that was possible. <gasps> oh my God. Okay, I love this stuff. She sent Physician's Formula Organic Wear, Organics Wear Mascara. I love that stuff. I wear it all the time. We got some Sally Hansen Hound's Tooth Things, Nail Things. Did you like how I showed that to you? Off in outer space. Some more Fake Out Organic Mascara from Physician's Formula. I love that stuff so much. Oh, this is an iPhone case. What? This is so sexy. Look, it's a freaking alligator. Do you see it? No, you can't because I'm looking at it right now. Do you see it? 
I know you do not. It is a sassy gator case. That is so adorable. I love it so much. Thank you so much. Next we have this really awesomely newspaper looking old fancy newspaper wrapped box from Alexis and Mackenzie. And I'm gonna slice this paper even though it makes me sad to slice it because it's so unique and so beautiful. But it must be done. Goodbye beautiful paper. Oh my god. We got some truck tape on here. You see that? That is sassy truck tape right there. It's like neon red and all that kind of... Can red be neon? I just invented a new color, you guys. Get excited. I'm so excited. And I just can't hide it. Why are Mmm. I will wear a fancy crown made of worms. Oh my god, I felt something jiggle and I didn't know what it was. Look at it jiggle. Look at it jiggle. Is this a pickle with hair? Gosh, I hope so. Look, it, he's covered in worms, too. It's like a sassy, worm-covered pickle with hair. <laughs> did you enjoy that as much as I did? Oh my god, blinded by worms. You put the slang in water, and it hatches gators from the inside of it. And last but not least, we have letters. So uh, thank you guys so much. Do I have worms in my hair? If I do, it's okay. It's just a fashion statement. We have an envelope with happy gumdrops on it. Look, don't they look so pleased? Don't they look happy? Happy gumdrops. And in here is a bag of rocks. Look, they look like gator eggs. I'm just gonna say that's what they are. And this comes from Alexa in New Jersey and uh, look at what she sent. I feel like this is a gift for all of us. It is the Salon Express as seen on TV thing. So we're gonna find out. Does this thing really work? And it will be an exciting day for us all. Thank you so much Alexa. This next very adorably wrapped space gator box comes from Allison. Uh, wrapping paper. Oh god, I almost killed it. Wrapping paper. Wrapping paper. Please go away. I like how it says open immediately. All right. Oh wow, this box just opened itself. All right. That's how we do it on the swamp. Look, it's a Hello Kitty bunny. And it's squishy. Ha 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 I like the things that squish. Can you tell? Oh, what is this? It looks like some kind of clothing item. <gasps> Shut the front, back, and all of the other doors. Somebody knows that I love old concert t-shirts. This is really amazing. I can't, I can't even believe that you'd be willing to give me this. It is a Pink Floyd concert t-shirt. I'm assuming it's a concert t-shirt. Or maybe it's just really old. Or maybe it's from some laser light show. I don't know. Nor do I care. It's old. It's holy. I like it. You will see this again. I promise you that. Ew, and we have an old book. What is this? Oh my god, it's The Exorcist. How exciting and disturbing at the same time. That movie's horrifying. Is this you? This must be you. Thank you for the photograph. I love your hair, by the way. Look at this Brock's Conversation Hearts. I love that candy. The white ones are my favorite. Just in case you wanted to know, what might this be? Oh, are these those sassy things that people wear on their leg? Can I wear them on my arms? Is that acceptable? Can I do I'm gonna do it. I feel like a werewolf. Watch me change in the full moon. <sighs> Ironically, I, I think it's a full moon tonight, so maybe. Ah, so sassy. Thank you, Allison. Moving right along. Oh, I'm killing things. Sorry, things. Next, we have this uh, very adorably decorated box. Ah, 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 making the noises of the dog. Why am I not using the knife? God. <sighs> Do I look depraved enough yet? Do I look crazy? Slicing, slicing, slicing. Sweet! Look, it's another pin with a flower on it. God, you guys are talented. I could never do this. I don't have the patience nor the brain power. This looks like more handmade goodies. I like them. Look, it's a pillow and it says Graveyard Girl Swamp Family and it's so pretty and psychedelic. There's little butterflies on it. I like it a lot. This is a keychain and it's made out of Coke tabs. Look at that. It's all like strung together. I wish I could do things like this. I would do, I would, I, if I had the skill set, 
I would do magical things like this. Aw, and this one is so cute. It's a swamp frog. And all these things come from Jocelyn. So thank you so much. I forgot to say your name earlier. I'm sorry. My camera is overheating and so am I. So I'm only gonna open one last box this time, but don't despair if you didn't see it this week because it'll just be in next week's Swamp Family Mail. So this last box that I have here is from Maeve and I swear, I recognize this purple zebra tape. I recognize your name. Have you sent something before? This is fancy, fancy, fancy. Graveyard girl. <laughs> That's me. Oh my goodness. She says she's 12. That is so cute. Look at all these drawings. It's a clockwork orange. Love you, bunny. That's so cute. We got a jack-o-lantern because Halloween is my favorite lifetime. Is this man cat? I think it is. He has green eyes. Bananas. Oh, the last one says, love you, swamp mommy. That's so cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. Thank you for the drawings. What is this? Why did I never have this as a child? I feel deprived, but not anymore because now it's in my hands. A treasury of spooky stories. We have a sass hat, sassy camo cap. Look at this. This is like a sassy camo type safari shirt, which you guys can't see yet. But look at that. That is sass to the max. And then we have this, which is my favorite color. Oh my God, this is hilarious. It says, ha, now you can't see me. So uh, thank you guys so, so much this week for everyone who sent me a letter or scrap of paper or something you color out of a coloring book or a box or bag or any of the things that you see here and thank you too just for being here even if you don't send anything at all even if you haven't sent anything if you're never gonna send anything thank you so much for being here and being part of it all and for watching and I love you guys so much and I will never ever be able to tell you guys how much I appreciate you and how much I'm so grateful to have you guys in my life you totally keep me going on a daily basis and I don't think I convey and say that enough but thank you so much. Thank you for being a friend. Thank you guys so much and I love y'all and I will see y'all tomorrow. Hopefully. Granted, I'm not filming some kind of Halloween stuff. Um, so I'll also see you in the future. Uh, but I love you guys so much and I will see y'all later. Bye.